We're at the 2019 West Coast Relays. This is the boys' seated 1600 meter run. <laughs> Amador Valley has two athletes in this race. Uh, Jacob Lawrence has run 430 this year. Uh, Jack Gray comes in with a PR of 429, but he's battling back from some sickness, so he hasn't been quite there yet. We're working our way back. Uh, I think the goal for both of them today is to be under 430. Uh, and if it goes well, maybe a little bit more. Uh, we'll see. Looks like they're about ready to get going. I thought they were going to get going a second ago, and they didn't, so filling air time now. They're set. And off. I'm not sure which stagger those guys were on, so they were outside or inside. Boys. Big group. There's I think 28 people slated to be in this race. Now, this is the one where there's 31 people supposed to be in this race. And it looks like a lot of check-ins. Uh, about 30 seconds at the, at the two. Let's go, Jacob! Let's go, Jack! They both were towards the back of the group, which is, you know, them being at 32 is just fine. Uh, It's 60 right now, so they're going to come through in 64, 65, 63 for the leaders and the guys right in tow. Guys are kind of buried in the pack here. They're coming through 136, or 416 pace at uh, 139 for, for Jacob and Jack. Good job, Jacob! Let's go, Jack! 139 for 600 is 424 pace, so the, the pack is running well. And there's going to be probably a point where some of these guys start to struggle, and our guys are going to have to be guys that move through. There's now Jack moving ahead of Jacob on the inside. They're going to be at about 213 at 800, 210 for the leaders. 67, though. 63, 67, boys are shooting. Zachary Woods. Doing the work at the front, but here goes Nicholas Rodriguez. And Charlie Hamill is just going to be in first. Let's go, Zach, get him on the car! Jack is going to be at 248 and 250 for Jacob. Go to work, Jacob, go to work! Jack's really moving up well after struggling a lot for this last week or two. He's making the move. We'll see if Jacob finds something in the last quarter, but they are coming through. 321 or 322 for Jack, and Jacob's 324. Jacob still has a chance because he has a big finish. He'll have to engage and find it. Charlie Hamill moving well. And Drew looking to win back to back races here. Let's go, Jack! Let's go, Jacob! 
James found something. Jack struggled after he moved. Probably moved too big too early. Jacob's gonna run right about 431 probably. Jack in the 434, 435 range. Finishing well. 4.30 right now, so he's not great. Uh, we'll see what the official times are here, but it's going to be about 4.32 probably for Jacob. Jack in the 4.34, 4.35 range, so. Ryan Campbell in the 4.9, 15, Earl Buchanan. 4.9, 59, Munoz of Aurora, Ryan, 4.9, 51. Of course, in the college park, 4.30, 33, but the winner, Charlie Hamill, with a 63, 9, last year, runs 4.23, 6.0. That event was sponsored by the Bojan family. Next up, Invitational Boys 16, also sponsored by 433.13 for Jacob. Jacks is probably going to be about 435. Second division for Southern Section last year. I don't know. Sockdale, 468, he's number one in Central Sexton right now. He was 10th in the Masters League last year. This is the last call for girls open 100 year old. Did check in? Central. 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 Central